Yeah. There's always something you can let announce. Yeah. Not the kind of creep you can do without. Yeah. It's not a good time to walk about. Yeah. 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 creep is the very funny creep. Good friends are hard to find. And yeah. even harder to live. Yeah. Impossible to forget. Yeah. Yeah. creep is the very funny creep. Welcome to the creep. We had time to last. What is it? Oh. <laughs> Just as I thought. <laughs> anyway, from what I can tell, you have only one problem. And that is, there is no problem at all. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you scared me. Yes, you do look scared. Uh, you know, it's doctors like you who always say that we entertainers we do not pay attention to our health. So, <laughs> yeah, now you're getting me scared. <sighs> There is something to worry about, though. What is it? Well, something celebrities like yourself hardly ever have. And what could that be? Well, real friends, AY. Real friends. <laughs> See, AY, I've known you for a number of years now. Hmm? You have touched many lives. But can you say that you have a friend. Yes, of course. Are you willing to wager on it? <laughs> How much are we talking about? <laughs> How did your test go? Well, uh, the doctor said I'm, I'm fine. <coughs> are you okay? Yeah, um, I'm fine. You just coughed now. How are you fine? Uh, do, the doctor said I have a little, little problem. <coughs> okay, did he explain what the little problem is? Mm, um, he said I, I have what uh, is called uh, obstetric uh, amophonous uh, influenza. Huh? <coughs> oh. oh, wait, do you want water? No, no, uh, I'm okay. Are you sure? I'm fine, I'm fine. Yeah. Uh, he, he said I have uh, what he called um, um, uh, obstetric amphibious influenza. Yeah. Induced by uh, inflammation of uh, cerebros, uh, cerebrospina and cortical membrane. What? Uh, capable of causing what he termed as. Uh, uh, Brushelitos Nicatus African. Lord of Jesus Christ, what a clean come, come, come. Is he related to an Oribopathic of the Uh, not at all. He's not a relative of, uh, Mene Mene Teke of Fasen. Uh, so keep your Igiaga to yourself. Oh, oh. So that means what you're saying is that this illness of yours has a, 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 a Spanish origin? Uh, it is actually, uh, Anglo-Saxon. Uh, yeah, laced with, uh, uh, English and Latin put together. Um, I need to go and rest. Uh, I'll see you later. Mm. Uh. Uh. Hello? Hello, baby. Hi, sweetie. Are you back from the hospital? I'm back. Oh, really? How did it go? The test went well. But I didn't. I think I'm going to die. God forbid. God will not forbid this one. Oh. You'd better just come down. Hurry. Hurry and come. Sweetie, I'm kind of busy right now. Can I meet you in like two hours? No problem. At least my corpse will still be warm before you get here. Is it that bad? I'm already making my funeral arrangements and writing my will. I'm 
checking, my aunts are checking. I can't even spell your name. Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming now. I'm coming now, okay? Oh. So you people are lounging while my sweetheart is dying upstairs? What is going on? He said the doctor said he has a little problem. Little problem? Yes. It didn't sound that way on the phone. That's the way the name sounded as well. What is it? Well, according to Gigi, quoting A.Y. who cited the doctor, uh, he said uh, it's a uh, and long complicated medical nomenclature. What does that mean? What does that it, mean? It's Spanish. But then why thinks it's Anglo-Saxon? Yeah. Where did he get it from? Only God knows. And maybe the doctor knows what exactly is wrong with AY. I'm telling you. Well, I can't call God. But I can call the doctor. Hey JJ, are you, are you going blind? Oh, I think I've lost my sight as well. Oh, oh God, oh, oh, I'm going. Oh, oh, wow. Where am I? Huh? This place is bright. This place is bright. Everywhere is white. Oh, Angel Gebra, I see you. Ah, but Mary, you made that move. Ah, Baby, please, yeah, please. Well, yeah, and why stop it? You can't die! 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 Oh, no. My tummy! No. My chest! No! My head! No! My head! No! My tummy! No. No. Where is the doctor? You said the doctor is here. Where is the doctor? I, I called him. I called him. Oh, thank God, he's here finally. Doctor, please, please, please. please. Hurry, 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 hurry. My tummy! I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. Oh. Hey, why? Yeah, doctor. Yeah, yeah. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. But, but, oh, I think I'm gonna die. Am I still alive? Hey, you will not die in Jesus' name. Oh. Holy Ghost, Holy fire. fire. Holy Ghost, fire. Shh. Uh, AY, relax. Relax. Let me examine you. Back, back. <laughs> This is more serious than I thought. Me too. Me too. <laughs> How is he? <clears throat> His condition is very fatal. What? I don't know how we completely missed it. I mean, an earlier diagnosis would have would have completely arrested the situation. Doctor, what is the prognosis? It is inconclusive at this time, until the other test results get here. But it is looking very much like a malignant heart condition. I suspect a tumor. Hey, hey crayfish don't bend this out water. What's where the bubble sees? Where this water come from? I manage. My bros, my bros. Now I know that you have many questions. I don't have all the answers. But he will need your prayers. And your attention. Yes, we the boys will be praying for him. As for attention, that's Mimi's department. Yes, I can do that. Oh, the first thing go join for this one too. It is important that you all understand. I'll advise that you pander to his every whim. You give him whatever it is that he asks. It will help stabilize it. The doctor, we go panda. Where, where? Is it okay? Baby, can you please get me another bowl of ice cream? That's your sixth bowl. Only a wicked person would deny a dying man a simple bowl of ice cream. Don't resort to blackmail. You're not dying. I'm already seeing my great grandfathers. I see your illness has not affected your sense of humor. Can you at least please go and get me another bowl of ice cream? 
Okay. Please wait. What again? I'm also thinking a visit to Treasure Island would help my situation. And have you died in the process? I don't think so. The doctor says like red wine. A visit to Treasure Island would help to rejuvenate the system. And more so, no one dies from pleasure. From the results, it seems that his chances are very slim. It confirms my worst fear. AY has a heart tumor. Unfortunately, it's done irreparable damage to the organ. It's now beyond repair. What? Beyond repair? Yes. For AY to survive, he's going to need immediate well, an immediate heart transplant. Plant? Did the plant add? I don't want to pass now. Not like that. I mean that AY needs to undergo immediate heart surgery. So it's in. So Osh, baby, we are talking about a medical operation. Yes. Without which he will surely die. Hey. They don't cash, bros. Sis, I beg you, you go give me some more dough. Make me watch, eh? Go market, go buy white fowl and red kind of. For what? Uh, this one don't pass ordinary, now. There is no time for that. The transplant needs to be done in less than two hours. He will surely die before... before you get to the motor park. What? Yes. yes. So, so what are we waiting for? One of you would surely have to donate a heart for the operation. Eh? Eh? Wait, so, so you're saying that we need to give him... A heart. Yes. <laughs> Quite understood, Doctor. Uh, what I want to understand is what happens to the donor? Yes. This is my dilemma. The donor will surely die. Who here will die for AY? But oh, Doc, that's suicide. You know, the Bible says that Jesus Christ did the same for us, and it was hardly called suicide. But Jesus Christ did not donate his heart. He did better. He donated his life. Who here loves A.Y. enough to die for him? You can all go upstairs and say your goodbyes. But, uh, Doctor, I would, I would donate my heart. Eh? Yes. Oh, do you understand what you just said? If you donate your heart, you will die. I know now. What would be the use? Bros not will die. Bros will write no book. It will be land. I get, I, I get to make money. Which can lie to live. This is what I call, call as giddy. I never achieve nothing. Even to buy a bicycle tire, it's difficult. I bet, daughter, take my heart. Mm. Oh! Mm. No. Take mine. Mimi. I will die without any life. Uh, daughter, uh, you can. Mimi, uh, I cannot let Mimi donate her heart. It is impossible. Doctor. I will donate my heart. Casey. Yes, yes. I must say, uh, I am getting a little over overwhelmed here. Well, doctor, let me resolve this. We can't afford to lose Mimi. Because she's about to be wedded to AY. Mm. Ah. JJ! JJ! Yeah. AY is up. Eh? Thank you. AY. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank God. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> it's me now, JJ. Where's Osh? Oh, oh, he's at the gate. gate. Osh! 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 And my Mimi. It was Mimi that took the heart. What? That's very correct. And why needs Mimi alive? As you can see here, Osh is a stock illiterate. And that's bad for AY's business. What do you mean? It's re. re. rehearsal. 
We oh, yes, answer. Hey, correct guy. Nice one. Twenty for you there. Okay. We answer to. Casey is very intelligent, but he has chronic bad luck, which is bad for AY. What? You can't use me for this job again. Hello? Hello? Doctor, I'm the best candidate here. See, we both share the same intelligence and drive and uh, punchon and business sense. Yahoo, Yahoo. Doctor, he is a former miner. Too corrupt for a stand up guy like Ewa. Just pay the money, pay the money now. Pay the money. You pay tomorrow. Nice one, nice one. You hear for me then? While all of this is happening, AY is dying upstairs. Whose heart do I use? Use mine! No, Doctor, use, use my own. Let me first off. Mine is the best. Doctor, you've had the gist of all this. Please, don't make a mistake. Use my heart. All right. I have an idea. It seems we will have to resort to this. In my bag, I have four balls. You will each pick a ball. This ball will determine exactly what will happen from now on. If you... If you should pick the white ball, you are free. If you pick the red ball, you will donate your heart. And so I ask... Who will have the right ball to save a heart? It seems everyone has their balls. I have to be very clear on this. This is your final chance to vote out if this is too much for you. You can call your auntie, your family members, anybody. Because this is a life or death situation. Your time starts now. JJ, huh? shall we begin with you? What is the color of your ball? White. Are you sure? Yes. Casey! Is that your final mm -hmm. answer, mm -hmm. Casey? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What? A white ball. What? Ash, it seems you are the weakest link. Mm -hmm. However, you are from Worry, so maybe you just might save the day. You know, say Worry boys know the carry last. Yeah, it depends. Ash, what is the color of your ball? A pure white. Finally, what is the color of your ball? It's white. You are sure? I'm sure. It's white. It's white. And so it seems, four white balls. It's not quite right. <laughs> nice one, guys. Thanks. Everyone does have their balls. Would you kindly show us the color of your ball? Let all see. JJ, let's see the color of your ball. Ooh. Casey, let's see the color of your white ball. Ah. 
Could it be Ash that therefore has the white ball? Then Ash, let's see the color of your ball. And as Jesus turned water into wine, it seems all white has been turned to red. Unless, do you indeed have the white ball? Hey, why? These are the friends you said will die for you? <laughs> the check, then. My job is done here. What check? I won the bets. What? Uh, bets? So. Wait. Wait a minute. Are you telling me this was all for a bet? <laughs> <laughs> 